This video is a tutorial on how to upgrade your PlayStation 4's hard drive using the PlayStation 4 Hard Drive Upgrade Kit from Oyan Digital. The first thing we will need to do is copy the saved game data to the included USB thumb drive so that it can be transferred to the new hard drive. First, make sure you are signed in to your PlayStation Network account. Then, plug the included flash drive into the PlayStation 4. We need to start by backing up your saved game data. From the main menu, select Settings. Then scroll down and select Application Saved Data Management. From there, select Save Data in System Storage. And then, select Copy to USB Storage Device. Select the game that saved data you would like to copy to the flash drive and later transfer to your new hard drive. Next, check the box next to which files you would like to copy or press select all if you would like to copy all of them. Then, select copy. Repeat this process for each desired game. We will now remove the PlayStation 4's original hard drive Fully power down the PlayStation 4, making sure the power indicator is off. Then, disconnect the power cable and all other cables from the PlayStation 4. Next, carefully slide the PlayStation 4's drive bay cover off of the system. Use the included screwdriver to remove the single inscribed screw that holds the drive tray in place. Remember to store all screws somewhere where they will not be lost. Slide the hard drive carrier tray out of the system. Then, unscrew the four screws from the disc carrier tray. Be sure to leave the rubber spacers surrounding the screw holes intact. Remove the original hard drive from the tray. Additionally, you can install the old hard drive in the included screwless hard drive enclosure for use as an external hard drive. Consult the product manual for instructions regarding this process. In this next step, we will install the brand new hard drive into your PlayStation 4. Slide the replacement hard drive into the disc carrier tray, making sure that the drive's label is facing up and that the SATA connectors are facing the open end of the tray. Then, secure the hard drive to the carrier tray using the same four screws that you removed in the last step. Slide the carrier back into the drive bay and attach it with the inscribed screw that was removed earlier. Lastly, slide the drive bay cover securely back into place. In this step, we will download the system software required to complete the hard drive update process. Start by plugging the USB flash drive into your computer. Open a web browser and go to the following page on Sony's website. You can click the link below or find it in the information section of this video. Once you've reached this page, click the link labeled, Do you want to perform a fresh install of the full system software? If so, then click here. From there, click the Download Now button, which will initiate the download of the system software. Make sure to verify that the file is labeled ps4update.pup and that the file is around 800 to 900 megabytes in size. Now this next step is crucial, so pay close attention. You will need to copy this file to a specific location on the flash drive. Navigate to the flash drive's directory on your computer and open the folder labeled PS4. Then open the folder labeled Update. This is where the update file should be placed. Before completing this step, Double check to make sure that the folder path on the flash drive is exactly as displayed in this graphic. Keep in mind that the folders must be labeled in all capital letters. Also confirm that the update file is labeled exactly ps4update.pup with no numerical extensions or other alterations. Once you have done this, eject the flash drive and remove it from the computer. We will now install the system software and initialize the PlayStation 4. First, connect a controller to the PlayStation 4 with the charging cable that was included with the system. 
Connect the USB thumb drive to the other port on the PlayStation 4. Hold the console's power button down until a second tone is heard, indicating that the system has been booted into safe mode. In the safe mode menu, select Initialize PS4 Reinstall System Software. Then, select OK. Wait patiently for the system to load the data from the flash drive. The system will then indicate that it is ready to be initialized. Select Yes to continue. Wait for the process to complete, and then follow the on-screen prompts to prepare the PlayStation 4 for use. Additionally, make sure to sign in to your PlayStation Network account immediately upon completing this process. In this last step, we will restore saved game data from the flash drive. Before we can complete this step, you will need to reinstall the associated applications by either inserting the proper game discs or re-downloading them from the PlayStation Store. Of course, make sure the flash drive is connected to the PlayStation 4. From the main menu, select Settings. Then scroll down and select Application Saved Data Management. From there, select Save Data on USB Storage Device, and then Copy to System Storage. Select the game that saved data you would like to copy to the new hard drive. Next, check the box next to which files you would like to transfer or press select all if you would like to copy all of them. Then select copy. Repeat this process for each desired game and remove the flash drive when completed. That's it! Enjoy all that extra space for new games and applications on your PlayStation 4. If you have any questions, head to oyandigital.com and click the contact tab.